Clean air zones could be created in Liverpool and Manchester by 2025 after a court ruled that the government needs to clean up its act on pollution. It could mean diesel vehicles being charged to enter city centres. The environmental group Client Earth brought the case at the High Court after the government refused to create the zones. Here's our environment correspondent, Judy Hobson. Pollution levels in our cities are illegal and dangerous. This bus looks clean until you view its exhaust through an infrared camera which detects pollution. The same with a car. Public Health England statistics show that in 2010, around 3,500 people died prematurely from air pollution in the northwest. 1,346 lived in the Greater Manchester area, 239 lived in Liverpool. Now a group of environmental lawyers known as Client Earth has won a High Court ruling which will force the government to act and come up with a radical plan to clean up our air. What the new plan will have to do is seriously address pollution in Manchester and Liverpool. We think the government needs to introduce what are called clean air zones. They will keep out the most polluting diesel vehicles from the most polluted parts of the town and city centre. But Client Earth says a year ago, government advisers said clean air zones should be created in Manchester and Liverpool. But they say the Treasury didn't allow it due to the cost. But they did give the go-ahead to six other cities, including Leeds and Birmingham. It's quite literally breathtaking. Uh, it's very blinkered and, and it's bonkers. The idea that some parts of the country, therefore, should get measures to help and others shouldn't, uh, is outrageous. And all this while medical evidence gets stronger. While the nose traps some air pollution, small particles can slip past and go on to damage the lungs and the heart. The very smallest may even get into the brain. When it comes to premature deaths as a result of pollution, Salford is the worst place in the northwest. Well, now the High Court has told the government it has to do something about it, and it has to do it quickly. In Greater Manchester, there could now be plans to restrict older diesel vehicles, especially buses and lorries, from going through the city centre. We've got to see cleaner buses, cleaner lorries, cleaner cars on our roads. And if you're having a clean air zone, it does mean sometimes being able to take the action that, that says when you can and when you can't uh, travel in. I think it's all exaggerated anyway, all this pollution business, isn't it? probably makes sense overall. I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's difficult to enforce, but yeah, why not? I'm always on the road or on the run, or even if I'm outside getting fresh air. What fresh air? <laughs> the government says it's committed to cleaning up our air and says Brexit will not delay its plans. But campaigners say action should have been taken much sooner. Judy Hobson, BBC Northwest Tonight, Manchester.